mae archifau yn anhygoel ac mae'r gwaith y maen nhw'n ei wneud sef diogel i ein gorffennol ar gyfer cenedlaethau'r dyfodol yn hanfodol. Mae archifau yn casglu a diogel i dogfennau sy'n ymwneud a'u hardau leol a sicrhau ei bod ar gael i'r cyhoedd am ddim. Trwy gadw'r dogfennau hyn, mae archifau yn golygu y gall bobl ymchwilio i hanes eu teulu, hanes eu tref neu hyd yn oed eu cartref eu hunen, a nhw'n gystal â bod o gymorth mawr i unrhyw un sy'n ystudio. Mae nhw'n gallu mynd â chi ar siwrnau anhygoel o ddarganfyddiadau. Ond mae llawer o bobl yn ansicr beth yw ddisgwyl wrth fynd i'r archif am y tro cyntaf, a ddim yn siŵr hyd yn oed beth mae archif yn ei wneud. Os yw hyn yn wir amdanoch chi, yna mae'r ffilm hon ar eich cyfer chi. The difference between an archive and a library is that when you come into an archive, you don't see the documents in the room that you're working. The documents are stored in locked strong rooms under very secure and uh, specialised conditions. And the point about archives is that each one is unique and irreplaceable. So it's not like a library book where you can get another one. Oherwydd bod angen diogelu'r dogfennau yn ei gofal, mae gan archifau set o'r iolau pwysig ar gyfer ymwelwyrdd sydd eisiau gweld dogfennau. You can use pencils, not pens. Um, you're not allowed to keep your bag with you. You need to lock it away in a locker. But when we produce a document, we advise you to handle it with care. Um, we provide you with support cushions and various other supports and, and weights and things to um, help you view the document. Er bod yn ar iolau i sicrhau bod y dogfennau'n cael eu diogelu, fe allwch fod yn siŵr y bydd y staff yn gyfeillgar ac o wyddys i helpu. We're all very welcoming and it's not just the, the building being accessible but it's the service as a whole being accessible too and I think um, what you see in the building, the accessibility here, the ease of moving around the building is reflected as well in the attitudes of the staff and how welcoming we are to any member of the public who comes to the door. We just had a request for a document for someone in the search room so we'll go and get it from the strong rooms if you'd like to come with me. The lights come on automatically when you open the door and here we have air conditioning so the documents are kept at the right temperature and the right relative humidity. Yn ogystal â chadw dogfennau, mae archifau heb yn gwneud llawer o waith cadbraith, glanhau ac adfer dogfennau er mwyn eu cadw mewn cyflwr sydd fedlwg ar gyfer y cyhoedd. The job of conservator is, is very important because uh, the public require access to these documents. So if the public were to handle documents that are fragile, they might be left with a pile of dust, really. Quarter session rolls, these date back to 1808, and each one represents about three weeks' work in conservation terms. There we are, it's a couple of uh, parchment documents that have been uh, humidified and flattened. They've been hinged in using uh, Japanese paper, so that the researcher can see both sides, but in fact they can be consulted without having to handle. Uh, this really does improve legibility and access to the public. My archive I entirely chwilio am voyo dogvenai u hachwanegi at a kaskliadai a badechen seni pavath o bethai ashai vodi didorzeb. Um, it's incredibly important that people actually donate things to the archives. People sometimes, I think, mistakenly get the impression that only the official records are important and worth preserving. But the little things that we produce from day to day can be equally important. Things like people's photographs, diaries, letters. They give a very different perspective to the official records. But when you use them in conjunction with the official records, it's, it's quite an interesting mix, bringing different sides to the same story together. Mae yna gymaint o straeon sy'n aros i gael eu darganfod ym mhob un o'r archifau ledled Cymru. Felly ewch draw a dechrau archwilio. Ond peidiwch â chymryd ein gair ni, dyma bobl sydd eisos wedi mentro. Don't be put off, you know, making the start because once you, people who do local history research or they research their family trees, and once they get started, it, it's a joy and it's a pleasure. It is that friendliness. Um, it's not the building an archive is housed in or even if it's open on a weekend, 
it's the people that run it. It's, it's a great experience. I mean, the staff are helpful. There's no need to be intimidated at all. They straight away they made me feel really welcomed and I was there every single day when the library was open, nine till six. What I like is that you start off on one thing but in fact you branch out into others and sometimes you're just mesmerised by all the other things that you really didn't go in for but they were so fantastic, just interesting, the history.